Hello again to everyone. Uh, you might be wondering what this strange contraption is on the top of my ride symbol here. Uh, what it is, is it is a sizzle plate, I think it's called, made by Checker Plate Stuff. Their website is checkerplatestuff.com. That's checker spelled C-H-E-Q-U-E-R. That's the proper way to spell it, obviously. This is a small strip here of diamond plate steel, or checker plate steel, whatever you'd like to call it. It's quite malleable, so you can, you can bend it in if you want the rivets a bit closer. But what this basically is, is a replacement for drilling your cymbal or using a normal plug chain or rivet chain that comes down the, the middle of your bow there so it gets in the way of your sticking. What this is then is to compensate for having this on the outside of that area where you'd normally have it, it has two of these little rivet chains here and they are, I believe, three or four millimeter brass bead chains. Uh, they will not come off that little contraption even though all they're held in, is, all they're held in with is a little joint there. Uh, this is a little rubberized rigid section here that holds it in place. What you can also do, there's two holes on either side there, is obviously you can switch it around so uh, the actual, I say, dangly bit of the chain is coming down this hole here instead of the outside hole. But just for demo purposes, I'll keep it where it is at the moment. Uh, so if you're interested in this, it's very, very, very inexpensive. I was, it was one of the only purchases I made on the day, uh, just because it was so inexpensive and so useful, I think. Uh, you can check it out at checkerplatestuff.com. So there we are, as you can see, it's nice and subtle. It's nice and subtle. Um, it doesn't. It really doesn't build too much either, like rivets can, you know, it doesn't get out of control. But what's great about this is, since the brass beads are quite heavy, uh, they do dangle over the edge on this model, but if you had a 22, this is a 21, if you had a 22 or a 24, uh, where usually some chains would go start dancing all over the place and wouldn't keep controlled, uh, these will. Uh, the beads are quite heavy, but they're not in any way brash sounding uh, or anything like that. So if you are interested in this, uh, you can get it, like I said, from uh, www.checkerplatestuff.com. That's checkerplate spelt C-H-E-Q-U-E-R-P-L-A-T-E, obviously. So there we are. That is the, I think it's called the scissor plate. Sizzle plate, even. Thanks for watching.